showcases at No Miss Studios uh -huh. in London. Really great studios. And back in them days, it was like there was a vibe. Yeah. You know, there was a canteen and all the bands were in the different rooms. Right. And everyone would go at lunchtime, like you'd stop down tools and okay. you'd go, you know, it was old school. <laughs> yeah. like, like, we're doing, like, it was like a, going to work. So right, right, okay. we'd all go in the, in, the, in the canteen at lunchtime and then um, we we knew that Weller was upstairs mm -hmm. and like Weller's like my all time hero, right, you know, right, right. Stevie uh -huh. Marriott. But um, okay. love Weller. Mm -hmm. And so I, I was only a boy. Then. Right. So he kind he was really nice to us and he was really cool and he kind of mm -hmm. took us under his wing and. He took the time to talk to us as kind of equals, you know, he didn't like look down on us or anything and, yeah. and we kind of hit, hit it off of him. And then um, we invited him into the showcase. I think we had about three or four record companies in and, and then we'd already started. I think we'd done one song and then the door opened and the record companies, we were on the stage, record companies were down, down there and the door was over there and <laughs> in, in comes Paul Weller and Steve White. And oh, I remember incredible. they didn't yeah. take no notice the record company at first. And I said, all right, Paul. And then they all turned around and said, Paul, well, that kind of. Excellent. <clears throat> it was a little bit like, oh, the pressure's on. All right. <laughs>